All right, so when you're metal detecting, you end up with so many little buttons and things that just aren't really very nice. And you just like wonder, I don't want to throw them away, but what do I do with them? So I was so shocked. I've been saving all these little like overall buttons and things and I tumbled them and they came out so pretty. And so what I'm gonna attempt to do is turn this into an epoxy coffee table. I think it looks pretty neat. I've never done one of these tables before, so don't watch for tips on how to do this, but I think it's a good concept, even if I can't pull it off, <laughs> but I'm gonna try. So some of these ended up being a little taller than my coffee table ridge that I have here. So I build it up with some polypropylene tubing and some hot glue and then I've caulked it on the inside. So, I just got my stuff. I've been waiting about a week and I'm gonna attempt to pour on this and turn this junk into something cool. All right, so I poured just a little on there to see if I'm leaking and I seem to be good. So I'm gonna mix up a little more. Okay, here, here it is done. Uh, there were a few complications. One, I underestimated my epoxy, and so I had to pull a few things out and add a few things in because I had a few things that were just too tall. But overall, I just really like this table. It was a lot of fun to make. And as you can see, it's just a really nice talking piece for when anybody comes over. Plus, Honestly, I think I get to enjoy this table more than some of my other stuff because it's right here where I'm sitting, you know, watching TV or whatever. So, anyway, I thought you guys just might think that was neat. I know this isn't. <clears throat> I know this isn't exactly metal detecting, but I think there's a lot of concepts you could do with your uh, your treasures using uh, epoxy.